You know, off the golf course, I'm pretty basic. I really am. I'm a jean, khaki, chino kind of guy with a basic black, white, gray shirt type deal. I've always been a Ralph Lauren fan, and so to be able to be sponsored by them, really a dream come true. I've been with them eight or nine years now, and they really have helped my style grow tremendously. So these are all the colorful pants or printed pants that I've ever worn. When my career's done, every printed pants I ever have, I'm gonna sort of put in like a little uh, picture case. The guy I have looked up to out on tour, who's done it really well, I think for a while, is Luke Donald. He's an artsy guy, he's got an art degree from Northwestern, so he understands what looks good and what doesn't look good. It's funny, I'm looking more towards the rock star type guys, the musician type guys, what are they doing? They just wear a lot of basic white shirts, black shirts, but they put a nice little leather jacket on top of it, or a colorful shoe on the bottom, just makes everything pop a little bit. We're getting the photo? <laughs> oh, stop it. Oh, stop it. Oh, that's awesome. I love it. I don't see guys iron their clothes enough. I mean, they bring it out of the wrapper, and you can still see the crease marks and everything. I mean, it takes five minutes to iron clothes. It makes you just look that much more professional. Don't wear a white belt unless you're wearing white pants. Go buy a nice tan, brown belt, black belt, blue belt, navy belt, whatever color belts to match the little hint of color in that shirt, pants you're wearing that day, and make sure the clothes fit you. We have so many chances to get fitted for the right clubs, but we also have chances to get fitted for the right clothes. It goes a long way to looking good on the golf course.